All right, so sorry about that. Uh, okay, so uh, where are we at here? So yeah, I did the, so the other thing I need to do now is basically the key in between here. Uh, so I got it twisting back and forth with the body, but um, as your leg comes forward, it actually, it draws your hips this direction, this diagonal, um, like this. Okay, um, because the weight of it's pulling it down because it's you're lifting it up. A lot of times people do it in reverse and it's actually wrong. Um, so basically, that would be my rotate Z. So I'm gonna do we'll do like six. Depends um, if it's a female, you do more. If it's a male, you do a little bit less. He's kind of a guy, so that might even be too much. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna key. Oops. I'm gonna key selected, and I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna type in zero on the first frame. Okay, so it goes boom. And then 12, it'll be zero eventually, but not right now. So then I'm going to go 18 and I'm going to type in negative six. And then I'm going to go to 24 and type in zero. Okay. So it goes from zero to six. And then you'll see at 12, because it's halfway between this negative six, it will also be zero. I don't have to type in zero there. And then negative six and then back. So watch. All right. It's got a little bit of sass now. A little bit of sass. All right. Beauteous. Okay. Um, now what I need to do is uh, kind of do the spine area here. So depending on what this is, okay, it's rotation. Um, it's FK, good, and this one. Okay, so what you do is you grab all three of these. So like this one, hold shift, select this one, hold shift still, and select this one. So I have all three selected. Okay, and I'm gonna go ahead and just hit S to key. And I'm going to, so as you come down, you're gonna compress, but I'm gonna go one frame after, uh, just so that it drags, because that's my low position is four. So I'm just gonna go ahead and go like uh, this a little bit, okay? Let me see something. Nope, not that one, not that one. This one moves though, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, so we're gonna compress a little bit. All right, all right. Uh, so at five, and then uh, I'm not at eight, I'm gonna go one after, I'm gonna go the opposite, I'm gonna roll this way, back a little bit, okay? So we'll say we're gonna go forward, I'm gonna do two forward, and we do um, minus two back, okay? All right, and then so basically I'm gonna do the same thing here, so uh, it won't be at 16, it'll be at 17, I'm gonna type in two, and then not at, not at um, 20, but 21, I'm gonna do minus two, okay? And then at 24, I got type in zero, okay? And it should, good, okay? Yay, now, the other thing that's gonna happen is it's like the hips, it's gonna move the opposite of what the hips are doing. So that means that uh, if this leg, uh, if the hips are moving this way with this leg, it's gonna move the opposite, so here, I need it to twist in the opposing direction this way. Okay, so we'll type in six. And then at 12. So let's make sure we got a key there. Yeah, okay, so six. I'm going to go to here. I'm going to type in minus six. Okay, and then at 24, I'll type in six again. Okay, so basically, you'll see that the chest will twist back and forth. Okay, that's good. Beautiful. All right. Now what we're going to do is the arms here. So I'm going to grab this one. I hope I can grab both at the same time. And yes, beautiful. I'm going to grab it like that. All right. And I'll just grab just this one. I'm going to go with the first one. I'm going to hit S to key. And because I got to set the initial key, if this leg's forward, this arm should be back. They move opposites. Okay. So there's that. At 12. So what I do, I did. Uh, at 12, we're going to go forward, okay? And then I'm just going to copy 1 to 24 here. So it goes back and forth, good. Do the same thing on this side. I'm going to go to 1 here. This should be forward. Hit S to key, 12. It should be back, all right? And then I'm just going to copy 1 to 24, all right? It's getting there, all right, good. Now, 
we need to do is uh, move these elbows. Now this, these are gonna drag slightly. They're gonna be a little bit different than doing the other things. Uh, it's gonna take a bit of manipulation. So his arm's coming back, right? So really, as it comes back, it should be um, dragging this way, like this, okay? And that's, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and just key uh, this, so uh, 40 degrees. So it's gonna go back. All right, and it's gonna go back. And then as it comes forward, it's actually gonna straighten out, okay, because of the drag. So you'll see it goes boom, and then, now this is halfway between this 12, so I'm gonna take whatever value this is, which is currently 25, I'm gonna bring that up to 24, and I'm gonna, by middle mouse button clicked and dragged, I'm gonna key select it so it's at 25, and then I'm gonna go ahead and also key it on one. And then you'll see it's subtle, but it's a little bit of a drag. Okay, we'll do same thing here. This changes considerably whether you're doing a. Um, okay, so this is going forward. So we're gonna go ahead and just kind of pull this a little bit forward because I don't want to completely straight. It looks weird that way. And I'm gonna key selected, and then as 18 when it comes back, it's gonna be bent more. Okay, and then I'm gonna take whatever 12 is, which is. Minus 27, so middle mouse button, click and drag 24, right click, key that, middle mouse button, click drag to one, right click, key selected. All right, so there's a little bit of drag, just a little bit of something, it helps a little bit. All right, now his hands look kind of weird, so I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can, um, just in general, I'm gonna grab both of his hands at the same time, just holding shift and clicking both, and I'm gonna try this curl, beautiful. I'm just gonna curl these in a little. He's got pretty ugly hands but uh, that should be fine. Okay, and let's look at the head. And his head is actually okay. All right, um, and that is sort of a generic walk. There you go.